Yes lads, how's it going? Danny here, welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video, what I've got for you is my future stars predictions. Uh, with any luck, it should be coming this Friday. If you're watching this when it, it, it's uploaded, uh, it could even be announced in two hours time if you're watching this as soon as I upload it. Uh, last year, I believe they they you know, they announced it uh, Tuesday 6pm. They, they, by announced it, I mean they said... Future Stars is coming Friday. That's all they said, basically. Uh, and yeah, if they follow the same pattern, it should be coming today at 6pm, the announcement. Uh, so I thought I might as well get this out before. I mean, they might even announce it today. So I need to get my predictions out uh, very quickly. Uh, this is just my views. I, I might have missed out some players. I, in, in these kind of prediction videos, you need to have a mix of uh, re being realistic and being adventurous, if that makes sense. So I'm sorry if you, if, you know, someone you're a fan of or like, you know, you support their club or whatever. Uh, I don't include them. I apologise. I, I can't get every... Like, there's loads of future stars, okay? Uh, I've narrowed it down to, like, a 23-man team, I think. If I don't include one of, you know, someone that you like, please comment down below if I missed him. And I, I apologise if I did. I can't cover every single one. Uh, as I said, I've gone for a mix of being realistic and being a little bit, you know, out there, a bit adventurous. But if I ever do, uh, if you're new around here, hit the subscribe button. Uh, if you're new around here, you, you enjoy videos like this, leave a like on the video. We'll get straight into it. They're in no particular order. As first one, we have Dest. Now, this guy seems... I, I'll be honest, I don't watch Eredivisie, but I have seen i have seen a little bit of him, and yeah, he seems alright. I've only gone for an 85. I have gone for... I think everybody is at least 86, apart from this guy, uh, just because, I mean, that's a big upgrade. These cards get big upgrades. If you remember last year, I think Vinicius Jr. was 77 rated, and he got like a 92, so they're going to get very boosted, okay? So I've gone for... Or let me do some quick. I've, done, I've gone for a plus 18, I believe that is. I, that's probably wrong. But yeah, we've gone for Dest. Uh, I'm going to try and get through this as quick as possible. I'm not going to try and stretch this out. We have a pretty obvious one. I believe most of you uh, agree with me in this one. Uh, Daniel James. Again, I, I believe everyone, um, you know, d makes. He makes everyone's predictions, in my opinion. He, he's a great talent, probably going to be a future star, so he's going to get in a future star promo. I've gone for a plus 14. I'm going to stop doing that just in case I get it wrong because I'm not going to get memed. A pretty good-looking card. A little bit low on a, on a shooting, but, I mean, as a left-winger, completely fine. We move over. Now, I, I'll be honest, put, hold my hands up. I, I've never heard of this guy, but uh, I, I've used a lot of different sources. I haven't just gone, like, stole someone. I've gone in Reddit. I've gone to, uh, to Twitter. I've gone to Instagram. I've gone loads of these, and people are saying, this guy absolutely carries PSV. I'm not that I might be absolutely waffling there, but people have said he carries PSC right now, uh, PSV. Uh, and I mean, what a card that that, uh, that future star card looks. 90 pace on a cam is uh, not bad with 91 dribbling. Uh, I have got these stats from career mode and I have just kind of boosted them in general. So I believe this is his exact card. Uh, if you play career mode and like you get him max potential, I believe I haven't played career mode. I might be absolutely waffling, but that was what was going around on Reddit. I might be completely wrong. Uh, again, a pretty, uh, a fairly obvious one in my opinion. We have a Mason Greenwood. Uh, this guy's actually got a five star weak foot in game, so he's even more overpowered. And I mean, this guy, this guy is an unreal talent. The shooting on this bloke is unreal. How he's got sixty six shooting on his base card is, is beyond me uh some of these some of these goals that i've seen are incredible uh, i've gone for a plus 20 nice and simple uh and just a very well-rounded card i've got that shooting up there because trust me he's shooting he does deserve better shooting dribbling's up there physical is up there with 82 so a very very good looking card uh he plays center forward apparently I, I don't know about that i think he's more of a striker but he's gone for center forward so he's got good passing stats for a center forward so you can play him cam if you want to now we have the obvious one. Uh, recently transferred to, uh, I was going to say Bayern Munich there. I was going to get absolutely rustled in the comments. To Dortmund, okay. Uh, and yeah, what a, what a phenomenal card. He's already picked up a couple in forms uh, and a team of the group stage, I believe. And I mean, look at that card. 94 pace. Again, these stats are just predictions, lads. He, he, could, be, he could have a lot less. I, I believe Haaland is going to get a, a future stars card. I, I can't see why that he wouldn't get one. Uh, and that, that card's going to be... Probably better than Ronaldo, let's be fair. So that's going to be like a million coin card easily. Move on to, again, I'd like to say a fairly obvious one, but maybe he won't get in just on the basis that there's so many Prem players. But hey, I've gone I've gone with him anyway. Uh, it's hudson Adoy, Incredible card. He could get a left wing card, but his base is a right wing, so I've just gone for right wing. And wow, what an absolute... I mean, the pace, the shooting, the passing, the dribbling, all phenomenal. I can definitely see him getting a, uh, a Future Stars card and... That's probably going to be a, at least a mil. Mate, mate, I don't know. I'm not good with, with market prices. But in fact, surely that car's like at least 700k on the market, I'm, I'm assuming. Another another English Chelsea player. Get that hyperlink if you guys are into that. 
uh, with Daniel, oh, Daniel James, Reese James. Okay, we ignore that. Uh, plus 13, I've gone with, and that looks like a very, very good right back. Uh, he looks better than player of the month Trent Alexander Arnold, in my opinion, just because he's got a lot more pace. Uh, maybe team of the year uh, Trent Alexander Arnold might drop if that drops, if James comes out, because that looks like a phenomenal card. He'll probably be like 300 k uh, So if you have a team of year Trent, sell him and get this guy. Okay, let's move on. Again, a fairly very, fa fairly obvious one in Schwal Felix. What a card. I don't know if in 93, he, he's definitely going to get one. Whether it be 93 or not, I'm not sure. I, I have kind of boosted it. I reckon to get at least a 90 rated. I don't see him being under 90. And yeah, that card is... I mean, that card's just ridiculous. That's easily a 2 million coin card. It gets a link to Ronaldo. So if you're into that. And you can play him striker, cam, right wing. With them stats, you can literally play him any, anywhere. That's a phenomenal card. We move on. This is this card. Uh, this card is an okay one. It's an 86, so I, I don't assume he'd be incredibly expensive on the market. However, he is the Real Madrid star. Uh, he's on loan to. Uh, it's like RCD something, Mallorca. Or something. Mate, I'll put it. Uh, we're gonna move on from that. Yeah, he looks like a great card. Uh, he looks like he'd be like maybe two hundred and fifty k on the market. Uh, he doesn't obviously get great links, but he does get Spanish like uh, La Liga links. So it's not a terrible card. Great pace and the, the dribbling stats are great. I believe he's like a midget because he's like, I, I think he's like 18 or something. So he's not going to be massive. Okay. Uh, yeah. So his dribbling's going to be great. I, I mean, I assume his agility is up there in the 90s. We'll move on to, again, a pretty, I, I wouldn't say obvious one, but... One that you lot would expect in these type of videos. We've gone for Gabriel Martinelli. Uh, one one bad thing about this card is he is two star two star, which is horrific. On if you play FIFA, you know how bad two star two. Even like two star weak foot is saying something, yeah. But when you have two star skills, it's saying something. So yeah, uh, if he gets an upgrade, maybe in the the winter upgrades to like a, even a three star three star would be better. Uh, two star two star is absolutely d disgusting on a card like this. So, if he does get upgraded, it will be a good card. But, I mean, if he remains two-star, two-star, I don't see much people using him. We'll move on to a an American. Uh, we had Dest. So, you could link, you know, soft link Eredivisie to, uh, to Bundesliga. Uh, we have McKenney, who's got, I believe, one in form so far. And people are saying he's, he's, he's great in real life. And that card looks phenomenal. I've messed up on the defender. I've just realised, what have I just done there? That would, that would be a Hullet card, uh, Hullet gang card. Um... He'd probably get like 80 defending or something. So, yeah, that would be a Hullet Gang card. And, I mean, you can play him Cam, Centre Mid, CDM, maybe even Striker with them shooting. I'm not turning into an Apenfez, but you could if you wanted to, okay? Move on to... We need to get a goalkeeper in there. And a lot of you are saying Merritt is the next big goalkeeper, stuff like that. I have included two goalkeepers, so we'll get on to the next one in a minute. But yeah, people are saying Merritt is a uh, is a is a good keeper. I'm not sure if did he get it last year. I don't think he did. But yeah, that looks like a great uh, goalkeeper card. Uh, then we have a we've gone for we're going to go through a range of Serie A players now. We have a uh, Paqueta, I believe I say you pronounce it. And um, yeah, people are hyping up this card. People are saying he's he's great in real life like that. Uh, the dribbling is great on this card, and it's an all round great card. The physicals up there for a cam. He he he, he honestly reminds just from them base stats. He might play like a base Ronaldinho to be honest with you because he looks pretty much identical to Ronaldinho. Uh, we have another keeper, as I was talking about. Uh, we've gone for Radu. Now, on this card, I've just took the exact stats of his max potential on career mode, and that's what that's what these stats are. Uh, he doesn't look like a, a bad keeper at all. The handling is a, and positioning is a little bit low. But apart from that, the, he looks phenomenal. And yeah, I, I mean, Syria, in my opinion, are lacking with keepers. Like, you have what? You have Chesney and Handanovic, stuff like that. They're not really that usable in game. So we, we, I mean, if Merritt or Radu wants to get one, that'd be great for anyone that rocks Serie A teams. Well, I believe we have a couple left. I'm not sure how many we have left, but we're getting there. Okay, so we have uh, Renan Lodi. Uh, this guy was a six starter left back, and apparently he's uh, he's pretty good in real life. So I've gone for Renan Lodi. We we move on. We 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 don't want to talk about left backs and right backs too often because I'll be honest, I don't really watch them in real life. Uh, we have Rodrigo. I've gone for an 88, but this can easily be like a 90, 91, 92 rated. Basically, the FIFA 20 Vinicius Junior. Um, I can see them boosting him up a lot more than this. I've just gone for a little bit of realistic. 
Uh, then we have another left back in Kieran Tierney. This guy 100% deserves it. Uh, he was pretty good at, at uh, Celtic and he got a league SBC card. And I used it all last year. Uh, a phenomenal card. That 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 Future Stars card is basically his league SBC card, but a little bit better. So we'll move on. I believe we have maybe three maximum left. Uh, Toadie Bow. <laughs> I probably said that wrong, but apparently this guy is incredible in real life. You know, he's showing good potential in real life. So I've gone for him. He's basically like that hyperlink to uh to is it Mtiti and Lengler, and obviously a strong link to Varane. So I mean, the the league aren't really exactly lacking in centre backs, but it's always nice to get another one in the uh, in a league. Talking about centre backs, we've gone for a incredible card in Tamori. Uh, 88 pace for a centre back, and uh, yeah, what a card! I can definitely see uh, Tamori getting in. I believe we have one or two more. Uh, I've gone for Tonali. Now he already has a league SBC card, so it might be a little bit dodgy. But what a fantastic card that would be! On it, that would be up there with the best CDMs in the game, like top five easily. Have you got any more? Yes, we do. Uh, Val Valverde. Again, probably said that wrong. I'm terrible at pronunciations. Uh, again, this guy can easily be Hullet Gang if EA want to. And um, absolute hero for slide tackling. Was it Maratta getting a red card? Took one for the team. We have, I think this is the last one. Okay, so we'll end it on a high with uh, Siyun Kun. Siyun Kun. Siyun Kun. Siyun Kun. Please tell me how to say that in the in comment section down below. I've butchered it. This guy is unreal. In my opinion, top three centre-backs in the Premier League. He is honestly unreal. And he... He very much deserves a future star card, in my opinion. I believe that's the end. That's the end. Finally, you've, you've heard enough of me waffling. If you made it this far, thank you very much for, uh, I mean, for getting this far. Not many people do that, to be honest with you. So thanks, everyone, so much for watching. Uh, if you're new around here, you enjoyed the video, subscribe, leave a like. It would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to shut up, and I'll see you, hopefully, maybe tomorrow, if you want to drop any content. Probably not, though. Peace.